What is up, my true Sag gang? It's your girl, Didi, the true Sag, and I'm back with another video. If you're new, make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, press the notification bell, comment down below what you'd like to see from your girl. Also, if you're not new, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to start off with my post notification shout outs, but before I do that, I just wanted to really shout out everyone. My post notification shout outs is something that I do at the beginning of the video to express my love for you guys. And today is a special day. So my post notification shout out goes to every mother out there. Happy Mother's Day. It is Mother's Day. I hope you guys are having a wonderful Mother's Day. I hope you are having a blessed Mother's Day. I hope you get show every love that you deserve. So shout out to all the beautiful mothers out there. So if y'all want to post notifications, shout out. All you have to do is positively comment down anything down below. And I will shout you out. So I did pull up some of these. I have 30 inspirational mom quotes to lift mothers up for Mother's Day. So... I am going to read these 30 quotes for you guys. And I'm going to eat because I have not eaten. I have had a rough morning. I'm pretty sure y'all can tell. But we're going to get into that when we get into our next video. So I set up my food already. I'm having chicken parmesan. Which I was going to show you guys, but I showed you guys yesterday, so it's like, it's the same thing. And I'm feeling very weak, so I'm going to just do this video for you guys. Because I need to get something out for you guys for today. And then I'm going to lay back down, you guys. I'm not doing no school, no nothing today. My body is aching. And like I said, I had a rough morning, so. I'm going to set myself up. Because y'all know me. I got this chicken parmesan. So I gotta set up my stuff. I got a banana today. I have the red velvet cake. I have the chicken parmesan with the two pieces of chicken, two ginger ales, and the two dinner rolls. So let's take a bite and then we're gonna get into this video. I'm gonna try to eat the whole thing with y'all. I don't know how that's gonna go, but we're gonna try. Because I'm not feeling good, y'all. So, I'm not going to lie to y'all. I have not been eating like that today. So, y'all can at least see the first bite. It's hot. I may have visitors. I don't know. I'm supposed to have my kids. <sighs> come visit me but you guys today I'm not feeling so good so I don't even know that's happening but I told people I want y'all to feel bad for me it's just today it's just not my day my body has I, like I told y'all y'all will hear about next video my nurse already told me she could tell that I'm not feeling good so let's get into these quotes so this won't be a long video I'm going to get it out so you guys can have a wonderful Mother's Day. Number one says, Mother is the best. Sorry, y'all. I need to slow down because I'm not feeling too good. Let me cover up my food because I do not want it to get cold. All right. So it says, Mother is the heartbeat in the home. And without her, there seems to be no heart throb. The next one says, I can imagine no heroism greater than motherhood. Period. The next one says, only mothers can think of future because they give birth to it in their children. That is so sweet. The next one says, a mother's arms are made of tenderness and children sleep soundly in them. Mm -hmm. 
The next one says, a mother is not a person to lean on, but a person to learn. Wait, mother. Oh, Lord. Hold on. A mother is not a person to lean on, but a person to make leaning unnecessary. Mm -mm -mm. The next one says, you can feel when your mom's proud of you. You can feel the love. The next one says, becoming a mother has made me next level confident. I've never felt more empowered. And that's on period. I love being a mother. I think out of everything I do, I love being a mother more than anything. Being a mother has gave me so much insight on life. It has gave me so much insight on this world. It has gave me so much insight of on myself. Like being a mother means the world to me. And I'm going to save my speech for at the end to my beautiful babies because I know they watch me. So, yes. Oh, let's try some of this banana, y'all. I hope it's good. It's, am I supposed to eat a banana if it's this right? I don't I don't know, y'all. It's a little green. I think I'm going to save this banana and um, take another bite of bread. That banana is kind of green. I was going to try it for y'all, but it's kind of like green, green. I'll take another bite of the chicken parmesan for you guys. Because I didn't get the fruit, you guys. My stomach was telling me that that acid is just something I didn't need. Mm -hmm. I would have spilled that little noodle right on me. Ginger rail. They took my ivy out. My hand got puffy, y'all. The medication was not going. So they took the IV out to now telling me that they're going to put another one in. Because my diagnosis had kind of worsened. The next one says, such a mystery business, motherhood. How brave a woman must be to embark on it. Huh? Bray, if y'all didn't know we are we are brave to take on motherhood, okay? Motherhood is not an easy job, and it never stops. It never stops. I noticed that. Daddy could stop. Mommy can never stop. There's no, no shade, no nothing. Mother job is never done. It's never done. And I love it. The next one is, if I have done anything in life worth attention, I feel sure that I inherited the disposition from my mother. The next one says, the influence of a mother in the lives of her children is beyond calculations. Now, I'm not going to put this link down there, you guys, because, I mean, I'm reading the whole quotes, so I don't think y'all need the link. This bread is good, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. That bread with a little butter on it. Kinda all I need. Oh, it's good. And like I said, I couldn't eat breakfast. My juice, two o'clock. I've been up since seven. So this is the first meal meal that I'm eating. Whew. And my body's starting to feel a little replenished. So it's starting to feel good. 
enough for me to eat. It's still having those complications, but I can eat now. The next one says... The influence of a mother in lives of her children is beyond calculation. Per. The next one says, mother here is nearly to divinity. It is the highest, holiest service to assume by mankind. The next one says, motherhood, all love begins and ends there. And that's on period. That quote is on period. Motherhood all begins and ends there. Period. I felt that one. The next one says, there is no greater good in all the world than motherhood. The influence of a mother is in lives of children is beyond calculation. Period. The next one says, to describe my mother would be to write about a hurricane. It's perfect power or the climbing, falling colors of a rainbow. Ooh. Mm, mm, mm. Are y'all hearing these quotes? Excuse me. The next one says, a mother's love for her, ch her child is like nothing else in the world. It knows no law, no pity. It dates all things and crushes down remorselessly all that stands in its past. And that is something I do. Period. The next one says, at the end of the day, my most important job is still mom and chef. Ooh, wait. The next one says, whatever else is unsure in this striking dunghill of a world, a mother's love is not. Huh. To period. The next one says, youth fades, love droops. The leaves of friendships fall. A mother's secret hope outlives them all. Better say something. The next one says, all that I am or hope to be, I owe to my angel mother. Mm, mm, mm. The next one says, mother is a verb. It's something you do. Not just something you are. What? Are y'all hearing these quotes? Speak to us. Hello, beautiful ladies out there, beautiful mothers out there. Listen to you there. This is about y'all. This is about y'all. The next one says, motherhood is the biggest gamble in the world. It is glorious life force. It's huge and scary. It's an act on infinity optimism. The next one says, Mothers and their children are in a category all their own. There's no bond so strong in the entire world. No love, no influence, and forgiving. Period. The next one says, having children just puts the whole world in perspective. Everything else just disappears. And that's that's really truthfully. That's true. The next one says, it's the job that I take most seriously in my life. And I think it's the hardest. It is very hard. But it's worth it. When I tell you it's worth it, look at your Beautiful child grow up to become something that you installed in them as a mother. It's such a beautiful thing. It's such a beautiful thing. Mm -hmm. 
The next one says, I've never had more appreciation for anyone in my entire life until I became a mom. That And that's so true. The next one says, only mothers can think of the future because they give birth to their children. Mm-hmm. The next one says, I believe the choice to become a mother is the choice to become one of the greatest spiritual teachers there is. And say it, and say it again. Let me read that one, one more time. I believe the choice to become a mother is the choice to become one of the greatest spiritual teachers there is. And if you don't know you are, baby girl, you is. If you're feeling low right now, if you're feeling down right now, if you're feeling like the day is just not going the way that you want it to go or that you deserve for it to go, just know some, baby, you are a one of the greatest spiritual teachers that is. And that's the best gift of it all, sugar. It is the best gift of it all. Because whether you are hurting, whether you are pay, whether you feel like nobody cares, whether you feel like nobody loves you on this day, let me tell you something. Your children love you. And I guarantee that. I guarantee that. I guarantee that. You may be failing at everything else, baby, but being a mother is something that you are not failing as. And I guarantee that. I bet you that one. You hold your head up high because I'm having a rough day today and I know. So somebody else may be. You hold your head up high and you understand that you are a wonderful mother. And you try your hardest every day you wake up and open your beautiful eyes and say good morning to your children. You are ready tried so you hang on in there because you got this we got this okay the next one says of all the rights of a woman the greatest is to be a mother and that's one period the next one said my mom smiled at me her smile kind of hugged me Oh. And the last one says, the truth is that no matter what, sorry, the truth is no matter how old we are, as long as our mothers are alive, we want our mother. And that's on period. Y'all, I know, I don't care how old my kids get, I'm going to be right there. Every step of the way, treating them like they too. <laughs> I'm a mama. I'm a mommy. So, y'all, it has been 20 minutes. About by the time I'm done with this intro, you'll have about 20 minute video. Um, I was gonna read some more, but y'all, I'm telling y'all, I don't feel good. And I just wanted to get something out for you guys. So I'm gonna do my speech and then we're gonna close out this video. Again, I want to wish all the beautiful mothers out there a wonderful Mother's Day. I love you so much. You are doing an awesome job. If nobody told you, you are the greatest gift that God has given us. I appreciate you for spending your time with your children. I appreciate you for sacrificing your body to carry a beautiful, beautiful gift for nine months and bond with that gift. And nurture that gift and take care of that gift when that gift was inside of you. And then you gave birth and you stuck by. And I appreciate you for that. You are a mother. You are a queen and you are a gift to the entire world. And don't you ever forget it. To my three beautiful children, mommy is so blessed to be your mother. I wake up with you guys on my brain all day from the time that I open my big, brown, beautiful eyes to the time that I close them at night and I give you y'all kisses while y'all sleep. I do that every night. Why? Because y'all are the three blessings that I would never, ever, ever regret and I would never, ever, ever change. 
your mother loves you with all your heart, with all of her heart. And I am so honored and so blessed that God picked me to be you guys' mother. And I am honored that you chose me to be your mother as well. And I will show you for the rest of my life how wonderful it is to be your mother. I wish you nothing but great love for the rest of your life that I plan on putting and planning in you to let you guys know what beautiful queens y'all are going to be. My three princesses, Aaliyah, Allie, and Alicia. I love you guys so much. And happy Mother's Day to everyone. Okay, you guys, so it's the end of the video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on that post notification bell. Y'all will be getting another two videos tomorrow because I need to let you guys know how day two went. And then I'm going to do an update on letting you guys know how I have been doing for the last couple of days because this has been some stuff. So I love you guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful Mother's Day. I hope you stay safe. I hope you spend it with your beautiful children. And I hope you get some time to yourself because we too as mothers deserve it. So Make sure you turn on that post notification bell. It's the end of the video, and I wanted the only ones that tell you when you turn on that post notification bell, go in there and select all because it doesn't do it for you. So you got to turn on that post notification bell so you miss my lives, my shorts, my mug bags, my challenges, my vlogs, anything that I choose to post, you, your beautiful or handsome self, will not miss. Also, follow me on all my social medias down in the description down below, you guys. Please go check out all my other videos because I did, I did, you know, talk about some things in a couple of other videos. So, go watch all my other videos and I wish you guys a wonderful Mother's Day again and I will see you guys in my next video.